phenomenal uh, thing. Uh, Advaita Kala is from Uttarakhand and she's been talking about this all through yesterday. I can't think of the last time where a party which is in power comes back with a renewed mandate and a, and a pretty good mandate. From 57, they only came down to 47. That's a phenomenal achievement in a, in a state where you cyclically, you, every five years, you change government. The chief minister loses and yet the party comes back to power. I mean, it, th it tells you something about the remarkable faith that people have in this one man and his ability to transform their lives. You know, Zaka, uh, Uttarakhand was really a Modi miracle. I was uh, I was also very skeptical about a BJP win there. I thought Congress yeah. uh, really had it in them or had the sh chance, really. Eventually, they didn't have it in a, them to pull this off, but had the chance to really come back. Uh, but the fact that the prime minister, once he got to Uttarakhand and started doing his rallies, there was a perceptible shift in the mood of the people because his connect with the people of Uttarakhand is direct. This is a state which does have a lot of its family members in the armed forces. There's a particular nationalist, um, uh, you know, kind of narrative that, that exists in homes, on the streets. Uh, a lot of times in the state capital in Dehradun, you'll see a lot of these gates, Zaka, mm -hmm. uh, you know, which are dedicated to martyrs. You won't see the number of those gates uh, and those kind of dedications in any city in India, Correct. which is for our martyrs and the armed forces. So there is a very, very profound uh, connect with this sort of, um, uh, you know, a sentiment. And on the other hand, also, I just want to address the Hindutva question that you brought up earlier. Uh, you know, Hindutva equals communalism is, is a narrative that has been debunked. So I think uh, one has to look at it in a more objective way, because Yogi Adityanath is somebody who does not necessarily have to wax eloquent on Hindutva philosophy or ideology. Mm -hmm. He is very much manifest a manifestation of that. And I think with his governance model that he provided, which uh, a lot of people are talking about this uh, La Bharti model, wherein there was a whole new constituency yeah. of uh, beneficiaries that received the benefits directly, thanks to the digital India planning and all of those factors which helped. I think this was an exercise even for the BJP to show that, okay, Hindutva gets bad press. There's certainly a rhetoric that has emerged, which has very often been offensive. But on the ground, when it comes to actual delivery, there is zero discrimination.